In today's video, we're gonna look at hyperlinks in Excel. I'm gonna show you three different types of hyperlinks and multiple ways to create a hyperlink within a worksheet. The first hyperlink that I'm gonna show you is the one you're probably most familiar with, the one that when you click on it, it takes you to a website. So we're gonna put our cursor in D19, which is where we have some text in a cell that says website. For this, we'll go to the insert tab. We're in the links group. I'm gonna click on hyperlink. The text to display is what we have typed in that cell website. You could change the text to display here. We can add a screen tip if we'd like to help the user get a little bit of a help if they're not sure on where that is gonna take them. We'll leave that blank. And then down below is where we can type our URL. So let's go ahead and type in the URL for a Wikipedia page on hyperlinks. Now that we've typed that text, we'll click OK. And within our worksheet, we can see that Excel is telling us that this is a hyperlink by changing the font to blue and underlining it. If I hover on top of this, it tells us that this will take us to the Wikipedia page for hyperlinks. Let's go ahead and click it. And here we have the Wikipedia page for hyperlinks. We'll go ahead and minimize the screen. Another hyperlink type that I want to show you is an email hyperlink. Right now we have this cell that says email mark. I'm going to right click on it and go to hyperlink. In this window, I'm going to click on email address. Text to display, email mark is good. We have the screen tip like we had before. Right here, we have the email address section. We'll go ahead and type in a fake email address. Excel went ahead and put in mail to. That's HTML5 language that is needed to send an email. Within this window, we also have the option of adding a subject. So by default, when we click that, the subject will appear. For the subject on this, we'll type in hours because the spreadsheet deals with employee hours. And we'll click OK. And just like our website, we can see that Excel formatted this cell to show us that this is a hyperlink. And if we click it, it tells us that it will open up an email to Mark with the subject of hours. And then one other hyperlink that you can do, and I don't think people always realize you can do this, is we're going to hyperlink this shape right here. You can hyperlink shapes. You can hyperlink pictures. I don't think people realize that all the time. I'm going to right click on this shape. I'm going to go to hyperlink. People don't always realize that you can hyperlink pictures and shapes. But another thing that people don't always realize is that you can actually hyperlink within your document. This button that we have says home. We can actually have this button take us to our home tab within this workbook. If we go to place in this document, I can click on the home tab. And then in the type the cell reference, I can actually change this so that it doesn't go to A1 when I click on the sheet. I can make it go to anywhere within this worksheet. So let's do A15. And I'll click OK. I'll click off that. Now this is a hyperlink. Watch what happens when I click this. Notice that it brought me to the home tab in A15. 